It looks something like this. Hello gorgeous, welcome back to my channel. I'm doing a unboxing with you guys today. I love these videos clearly because that means I bought a new a new piece of candy to add to my candy box. I don't know what that means. Disregard what I just said. <laughs> I bought a new Louis Vuitton and I'm really excited to share it with you guys. You already know what this is because you clicked on the video so you know what the title is. So let's open it and see what I got. So Louis Vuitton came out with a new collection this summer called the Summer Escal. All of my French fans will probably tell me that I pronounced that wrong and I'm okay with that. But I did look it up on YouTube and I'm repeating it the way that it said it. So I, I hope I'm saying it right. So I have just been obsessed with this collection because it's pastel, it's beautiful, and it's so different than anything else Louis Vuitton that I have. And the thing is, is that they're sold out everywhere. Like worldwide, cannot find them anywhere, and they're super hard to get your hands on. And the people who did get their hands on them put them up for sale for way more than what they bought them for because that is the name of the game. And it's because people like me will buy them. But I didn't want to get a, a huge bag or something, just in case it was something that I didn't use all the time. So what I went with was the Toiletry 26 bag, which I actually, I've been wanting this particular Louis Vuitton bag for a long time. I asked for it for Christmas. Uh, I don't think it was this past Christmas, but the Christmas before. And Matt went out looking for it and could not find it anywhere. He called Louis Vuitton, they tried to track it down, they could not find him one. So I was super excited when I found this. So I'm not gonna waste your time with the dust bag because quite honestly, I left it inside. I, I was too excited, I took it out. Isn't she beautiful? It looks a little bit blown out here on camera. So I'm gonna in, put some insert shots so you can see the color beautifully, perfectly. The only word that keeps coming out of my mouth when I look at the, this is beautiful because it's so pretty with the pink to the yellow to the greeny, bluey, purple. Ugh. Louis Vuitton, you did good. Oh, you did so good. So this is the Toiletry 26 bag. I've been wanting this bag, like I said, for a very long time and it's literally just a toiletry bag. There's nothing inside, no pockets, nothing. But I like the size of it because it can go under your arm and be the perfect Clutch. Whenever I carry my bags like this, I remind myself of my mom, all Stacy, which is my dad's mom. She always carried her bags like this. Like some of my most vivid memories of her when I was little is her always having her purse under her arm. And I do that all the time. And whenever I do it, I'm like, oh my gosh, that's exactly what she did. Anyways, okay. So because I could not find this anywhere on Louis Vuitton, I actually bought it on Poshmark. So it was my first time buying anything on Poshmark. I sell stuff on Poshmark all the time, but I've never bought anything on Poshmark before. So I was a little bit nervous, a little bit like, ah. And I've never, I, I bought one Louis Vuitton bag secondhand um, years ago, it was my Speedy. I have that video, you guys can go back and watch that if you want. Um, so, and I had a great experience. So I didn't have any qualms about buying a, second, a bag secondhand. I just had never purchased anything through Poshmark. This is a brand new bag. It came with everything. It came with all of all of the paperwork, the original receipt, the paper that it was wrapped in, and the dust bag was in there too. I mean, everything, everything was in the box. I was actually shocked. It was as if I purchased the bag myself from Louis Vuitton. It was packaged exactly the way my bags from the store were packaged. So I was had a really great experience. So let's talk a little bit about the Poshmark experience first. Um, this video is not sponsored. It's just for anybody who's wondering about purchasing from Poshmark, because I was before I did it, what to expect. So I found it on Poshmark, which is an app on my phone, and I think that it was listed for like 1100. And if I'm not mistaken, I think the bags from Louis Vuitton are being sold for 675. So you can see what kind of markup. It's almost 50% or twice the markup because, um, that's what people are paying for them because they're so in demand. You cannot get them in store. And the people who do have them, there's, you know, we covet, we covet these bags, the people like me. So I saw her listing and I countered her offer. I offered her 900 for it and she took it immediately. Um, I want to say she shipped it out like the very next day or something. But the thing is, is that if you buy something from Poshmark that's over $500, they don't ship it directly to you. They first ship it to Poshmark. They authenticate that it's real. 
And if it's real, then it comes to you. If it's not, and they find out that it was fake, then it goes back to the seller and you get your money back. So that made me feel a lot better because there's other places you can buy bags from that they don't authenticate it. So I thought that that was, that made me feel a lot better. And then it came in the most perfect condition and I love it and, but I'm not gonna use it as a toiletry bag because it's too beautiful. I want it as a summer crossbody bag. So I know you're looking at this and thinking like, well, how can you make it a summer crossbody bag? There's literally nowhere to connect hardware to. I'm about to show you some magic. Y'all know I love turning my bags into crossbody bags, especially being a mom. I need to have my hands free and I love this. It's the perfect size for a crossbody bag, but you know, like how do you do it? So I found this company on Etsy. Again, not sponsored, just something I found. And it is an insert that goes directly into your, it's made for the toiletry pouch, the 26. And you just put it right down inside of there. But first I chose Whisper Pink in case you wanna know the color. And it's got two pockets, so it automatically turns your bag into a purse with pockets. It comes with a little thing if you wanna put up, have a place for your cards. It fits perfectly down into the whisper, or whisper, into the pouch. I just put it down there and then I take my fingers into those two corners and push the pouch down so that it sets in there perfectly. It also acts kind of like as a bag filler to kind of fill out the bag, which is nice because you know how these bags are. They're, they're a painted canvas. So, um, or maybe this one's leather. Yeah, this one might be leather. I mean, I actually don't know. But the thing is, is that they kind of can get crinkly and lose their shape and look misshapen. So that is so cool. But then it comes with a chain. So I went with the 120 centimeter gold chain and it's got little links inside of the thing. You can see it right there. So I'm going to just pop those on. And for this one, I'm gonna go up and under the zipper so that it can zip and still, or all the way and keep the chain on. It's gonna make it look like it was meant to be made this way. It's so cool. And then now, I just zip it and I've got a crossbody bag. Is that not the coolest thing you've ever seen? Here, let me stand up so you guys can see how it hangs. I love the way that this bag lays with this chain. You would never in a million years know that this chain and the insert weren't made by Louis Vuitton because they, they're they just perfect. They go together so perfect. And it was so reasonable. Here, let me look up actually how much it cost. I bought the chain and the insert together and they cost $58.86 and they came from Handbag Angels, which is in the United Kingdom. Um, I don't see that I paid shipping, so it might have been free shipping, I'm not sure. I'll link all of this below for you guys if you're interested, because apparently on Etsy, you can buy these convert kits for any Louis Vuitton bag that you have. I saw them for Speedies, which is really cool because I never ever carry my Speedy, but then I'm thinking, if I could make that a cross body, I might actually carry that. So, and also I have another bag that I love, but I never carry. That's a Louis that I could also turn into a cross body. It's just, it's a game changer. So look it up, check it out. I really think that it's a great way to use your designer bags in different ways than what you have always used them for. Okay, so what do you guys think about my new bag? Let me know in the comments. Would you go with a pastel or a bright color designer bag like this or do you feel like they're too trendy? I went with the lower end of the bags just in case in a year or so I feel like, ah, oh, that was so trendy. Now I don't wanna carry it. But it's so beautiful and like it's got that tie-dye pastel look to it that I feel like I'm going to love it for years to come and it's one of those bags that I could totally pass down to Ken. I feel like she would absolutely love it when she's a young adult. I'm not talking like 13, I'm talking about responsible young adult. Let's just keep it in check there. Um, but again, I paid more for it than you would pay for it if you bought it new, but it's not something that you can get right now. And they're gonna be limited edition. I know they are, which drives me crazy because the bags that you want that are so unique and cool, they're limited edition and they make like this many for a world full of women who want these bags. But anyways, let me know in the comments below what video you wanna see from me next. Let me know if you think I made a good decision on this bag. I'm gonna take a bunch of pictures with it and style it and show you how I wear it. And if you have the toiletry pouch, seriously consider getting this convert kit because it is awesome, awesome. I'll post some photos styling this um, on my blog and I'll link it in the description box below so you can see what it looks like with my outfit. And thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all so much. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn the bell notifications on so you can be the first to know when a new video goes live. Au revoir.
I love this. I feel like it's great. I can go out and run errands and my makeup is not gonna melt off my face because I have nothing on my face except for some cream blush and a little tiny bit of bronzer. I mean like the most minimal makeup and but you still look fresh.